What is up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Rolo, and welcome to the fourth episode of Pioneers of Pagonia. So, for today, we are going to continue on the trend that we had for the previous episodes. We were busy destroying these camps over here. We expanded to this little area here with a bit of problems. We have a shortage of uh, different tools that we need. I think pliers is also well added. Pliers is also something that we do need. Um, that's definitely something that we need to to take a look at. And um, we do have a shortage of coal at the moment, unfortunately. But we are working on that so that we can really plan on, on making a decent ends meet here at the moment. We want to get rid of these bandits over here because there's a lot of resources around this mountain that we want to to get to. But to try and get rid of these bandits, it's definitely going to be a bit of a challenge. So at the moment, I am just prioritizing building some tools, some weapons, in order for us to get enough guards so that we can take on that little piece. So I am going to build a new guard tower. So this is just to extend our reach into claiming this area over here because like i said this is definitely going to be one of the main 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 folk so i'm going to try to move to claim over there and our patrol points will be to try and kill these bandits it, there is a lot of them i think one of the big things that we do want to get to i'm going to prioritize this one so it's going to increase our strength of our units um we want to get our power combat power to be higher so I think what happened in the previous episode, a lot of the bandits actually stole some of our coins and our um, saved, or well, yeah, basically some of our treasure, our silver treasure, because I do think that there's a bandit camp here on the right hand side. Oh, there's, there's specters here as well. That's going to be interesting. So... Yeah, we really want to get rid of this, the wolves. There's two wolf dens. Um, we have, we do have our fear notes, but I want to get ten of them before we can actually go and enter the the dangerous zone of killing the wolves. So this is a very very difficult map, but I think actually having this area here around the mountain to get all of those much needed resources will definitely definitely be very very useful so i think for the different smeltings we have a lot of enough we okay, don't have a lot a lot of iron bars yet but i do want us to get a, a bit more strength with the coins so i'm gonna um put that as a priority because that will increase our overall strength even though we will be able to create more recruits and more units that we can can use at the end of the day, it's really, really, really important that we also ensure that their strength is up. Even though it's a little bit, it's, it's a very small amount, but it does help in the long run. So at the moment, I am just training a bunch of them um, so that we are prepared. So in the cases where we do need to go in and, and attack, we do have enough, let's say, cannon fodder, but we do have enough of them within storage so that we can quickly call on them we don't have to train them etc so we are just going to run through it a little bit we are creating a lot of wooden spears um, and i think there will become a point where we will definitely train a stronger units i i do believe that like the base strength of them is the same it's it's one more for a soldier so at the end of the day i don't really feel like it's that big um however because it's percentage based increases their strength is quite gets quite the jump especially with a veteran soldier let's just wait a little bit more okay disguise thieves are definitely a problem we need to train more fear nodes that's for sure and i think over here i'm gonna create more and torches because torches is definitely one of the core things that we do do require but these bandits over here it's going to become a little bit of a problem so you guys should patrol this area get rid of these bandits 
So with them attacking the, the whole time, they will eventually... Um, yeah, you can also get stone now. They will eventually trickle down their, their facilities. But... Yeah, it's still not... It's not always enough. So, yeah, it seems like we are starting to slowly but surely moving towards this little area of them. I do think I can take off the priority from the coin smith or the mint, um, because we need to prioritize the, the coal to different locations. Right, so let's see. We still need some pliers and hammers, which are the main the main tools that we do need. I just I just hope wish there was an easy way for so this guy I'm just gonna put them on infinite so that they can gradually create the tools as we require them. Right, I don't really know if I want to send in the fear notes just yet. Ah, oh, this spectre, let's let's just see if I do put them there if they are able to go outside of my territory. Indeed they are. Okay, so that's that's cool. They are able to go outside of the room. Alright, so we defeated the one bandit camp. That's awesome. That's super awesome news. So for these guys, yeah, I'm gonna wait on the Aerosmith so that stone masons will definitely be of use. A disguise thief was exposed. Nice work, Ranger. That is exactly what we want. We want to get rid of these disguised thieves. Um, I guess they stole weapons. That's fantastic. So I think, yeah, we don't have a lot of weapons in store anymore. Oh, they actually stopped, so you need to create 30 weapons for me, please. Because we need it. We really, really, really do. But I think all of my... I should all be happy. So three more people per minute. That's actually fantastic. Who's setting up guard there? I think these guys are setting up guard. I can't really allow them to go any further, but they will properly defend this area well while we can. And the carriers. You see, that's a problem. So if I lose resources that thieves stole and they drop it close to the wolves, then the carriers will try to get them. And that's the main issue that I ran into the previous time. They all died here and this massive wave of wolves, werewolves, started to build. And that was just, that was horrible. So these are all thieves. Uh, yeah, I really don't know. There's definitely a camp there that I need to get rid of. Because there's a bunch of stuff laying around and it just looks very untidy. Let's just see what's happening here. Yeah. Alright, seems like we do have the upper hand here. Yeah. Which is great. Yeah, I know that these guys are going to keep stealing a bunch of stuff. Please just don't, don't steal these silver coins, I really ask you. So we have 16, almost 20% increase in effectiveness. I swear, I'm losing so many people just because of having these thieves. So if we can, if we can properly get to them, like the patrol point is there. I mean, there's, there's not a lot of them left. Now we should be fine. Then we have a lot of open and free space. And our explorers can also not be scared anymore. Because that's why we don't really know what's happening. Because the explorers keep dying as well. But I actually wonder. I think I can put this tower to better use. Yeah, I honestly think I can put this one to better use to defend this area here. Maybe reduce the amount of soldiers and increase the amount of rangers that we have for them. Just because of the fact that there are a lot of thieves that are stealing a lot of stuff. And we really need to 
to cater for that. I do think the trading is done. It should be done. Well, not yet. We're we waiting for border stones, it seems like. So, or are they actually busy taking it to them? I have no clue. Mm -mm, doesn't seem to be the case. But that's fine. That's all, all good. So I'm going to keep just fast forwarding here. We should kill these last three bandits. And then this little area should be ours again. There we go. All good. So I'm going to set your claim focus to be over here. But there's a massive amount of resources and stuff that I really, really, really need. And then I'm going to put up some uh, some iron mining facilities. I don't think there's any coal here, so there's definitely a lot, a lot of iron, so I want to put up these iron facilities down here, and uh, then I think we should be good to go. Yeah, so I don't have too many limestone, well that's, that's fine, we, we had a, a good, a good starting point for that, so I'm not really too to bother it. I think for tools we are going to let them just create the tools as needed because I think we are on a good spot now that our ex expansion here is is doing well but I do still want these two to focus on building some wooden spears still just so that we have that buffer you know so whenever there there's a situation where we do need additional strength we do have the capabilities to do so. Alright, so I'm gonna prioritize the weaponsmith. Especially this one. Not this one. Because we do want we do want the silver blades and we So we really need to get those fear noughts. Get get them ready in order to take on the the wolves. Because if they attack your units, they basically claim it. And yeah, I see now there's this problem. They killed Mafia Nords. You serious? They killed Mafia Nords. Really? That's that that sucks. That really that really does suck. But yeah, it's fine. So this guy you can also produce whatever you require. Those are thieves and Set a patrol point. Attack them! Like, seriously. You have such a massive bonus, or such a massive advantage. But still, they get killed so quickly and easily. Look at that. Like, how many... How many soldiers do I have to to sacrifice just so that they can actually do something? Like it's, it's it's really ridiculous. All right, uh, so you guys, please, if you can, claim this little area for me so I can start expanding. 
So, goods have been delivered. We needed to complete the bear statue, I do know. So this has been completed, so let's see. I don't think I have iron lances at the moment. But I guess that's the one that we need to do. Weaponsmith, yeah, if you are building the iron sword so you can go down, you can focus on the iron lances. Yeah, there's another band, a few bandit camps down that way around. So I'm going to keep this guard tower over here just to. Please don't claim anymore. Please, please don't claim. I don't want you to get into trouble. So, for you to claim, I'm going to give you that spot. You are more than welcome to claim that little spot there. Because if I can build that, that statue, it will definitely give me some more... Um, so I guess I need to get to the friendly state, a friendly state of the um, of our neighboring village, and if I can do that, then that's a massive plus for me. But yeah, I just need to be very, very careful, just to stop it in time before it becomes a problem. There we go. Stop the claimings. And hopefully we can build down our little path to success. There we go. So it needs iron and stone. Okay, so oh, that's that's quite decent. Brand bore fortitude. Still don't know what it gives me. Symbol of strength and resilience. Observing it may observing it fills many with motivation and determination. Oh. I think I did read that in the previous episode. Reducing spears. And these guys are just gonna keep claiming. That's perfect. So we can start building our little mining institution here. Let's make sure that it can get to that side. Yeah, let's build it here. So I'm gonna build two iron huts. Now there's a bunch of silver. But I think for silver. I'm just going to build one, unless there's silver on the other end of that, no. Coal, there's no coal, I think the, this is all iron. And then quarries, so I'm going to build th three quarries. There we go. Uh, we're gonna connect it like such. There we go. So now we're gonna get. Okay, I think there's copper here as well. But not. Not a lot at all. Okay. So you have a 123% increase in damage. She's the. These thieves are becoming a menace. They're coming through these guys. They're coming through their territory. Do I even have fear notes? Why not? What? I, what? Oh, I'm not actually training them. But we have a lack of light armor.
Waiting for material because they need labor. Yeah, that's the that's the other thing. I don't have the labor for it. Hmm. Yeah, I know something has been stolen. I bloody steal everything. Honestly, wonder if I can self-impose the gathering of leather-based goods. So I do have a hunter's lodge with all of those things are outside of my territory. I can build another one. But, however, what I am going to do is I'm going to claim this area over here. It's, I said the claim focus to you. To that area. Guess we are waiting the border stones first. But I think because it's outside of my territory, I'm not able to hunt. Which does make sense. Because, yeah, I really need that leather in order to create the fear nodes. I should preserve the natural environment as well. I just feel like there might be some dangers hidden in here that I do not expect. Yeah, then I think our hunters are busy. Just keeping an eye on where these guys go and what their plans are because, yeah, like I said, I want to be very, very careful where I allow them to go and allow them what to do. Okay, we have a lot of guards. I'm going to be about that. Let's set the claiming center to there, so you can just get this little area above where we are now. Then I'm gonna stop them again, because then then I think we do have quite quite enough to start with or to work with. Because the, unfortunately, the light armor is, there's 29 orders for the light armor, but I guess that's just for what we require them to do. Get this part, why are you just skipping this little block chunk here in the middle? There you go, and then you can just stop claiming. Please. And uh, I have an area for hunting. But I also want to add a forester. Because I do believe a forester is needed for the sustained... Well, to sustain the environment. Yeah, yeah, I need... I will get to those thieves. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. I guess this is a tooling issue, indeed it is. And how far does this guard tower go? So they can actually patrol over here. 
So I'm gonna put the claim focus over here as well. So you have a 127% increase in essentially the effectiveness. Rangers, I'm gonna give you the the no for now. Just gonna wait for a few fear knots and then we can actually go and attack the wolves finally. The stoolsmith is producing what he can when he can, that's perfect. And then this would shop as well. Ah, oh, no. Yeah, but this is because of the rangers detecting the thieves. Which is actually perfect, because they get 1 plus 1. So the rangers are actually stronger. Okay, so they actually have increased value against thieves. Is this thing done? It, it is indeed. It's okay. No, it's not done. They're still building it. Because I get eighty percent, so they also want me to supply the output out. Post villages. I need iron lances. <laughs> How many do I need again for this trade? 38. 20, 30. Ah, let's just make it 40. And for you, still some silver blades, please. And yeah, let's start getting some armor, but you, do, you need staff. see these are traders that's all good yeah but there's a bunch of bandits coming through yeah but please just leave my fear notes alone i really really do ask you we'll save 20 i'm just gonna train like 30 more i think this military camp is full okay so now that's that's fine I think we are still lacking the the light armor at this point, but you know what? Let's uh, let's start moving towards the the wolves that we want to get rid of. Because they have a 200% bonus against them. Wow, okay. That actually went... was a lot easier than I expected it to be. But let's just wait for a few more and then we can attack the other section because they do claim them. Well, that's, that's fantastic news, Shock. There's a lot of. In gods, yeah, he. At least, at least the normal gods are really, really cheapo. Cheapo. So I don't need to be too stressed about them. And I mean, I can train them. They are a little bit of cannon fodder. So, honestly, these things, I think, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let you still focus on making some weapons. And you can just build whatever. I th honestly think if there's some spaces, I'm going to start building some uh, storage facilities in these small little empty areas so that whatever I produce I can produce enough 
Okay, so we have a construct right here, so that makes things a lot easier. And these trade carriers, they've look okay, delivered a few iron lances as of yet. But that's that's all fine and dandy. As long as this area here that we opened up, if there's still enough deer and stuff that can be hunted, I feel a lot more comfortable now. Like, I do believe. Yeah, they're still kind of in a bit of a treacherous area. So, yeah, I think for now let's see how much. Okay, I, I have six now. So. You guys can go there. Okay, another hostile camp was defeated. Get rid of the wolves. Okay, that was super, super easy. But I have a massive problem now with... Uh... Yeah, I'm going to keep you guys here. And for this, I'm going to minimize it to a few and increase that. You can start claiming again. These are all thieves. Okay, I really need a... I really need to build a... Um, a what's it called? Where is it? A garrison. I really need a garrison. This garrison isn't really in the best location, but I, I do need it. Get away, thieves. Ugh, they're stealing food. And everything in between. Your claim spot can be here, please. Thank you. Alright. So, I'm going to destroy this guard tower. And I'm going to build one that's a lot closer. So, some yeah, around here. Reason being is, since it's a lot closer, there's a lot more... Um, it's a lot closer to start claiming this area here around the bottom and then I can get to this apparently mysterious location and I do believe I really really need need that and I does this thing not done yet I guess I guess it still needs d a different different set of resources. Yeah, but we have a lot of... We have a, enough fear nodes here now. But yeah, I do believe... I do believe there's a lot of other stuff going on there. With thieves and... Uh, I can't really explore with them. That's fine, we'll keep the patrol point here for now. Okay, so the thieves were exposed over there. Great. Okay, so this opens up a lot of potential. For me, yeah, there's a lot of a lot of stone that I can gather, a lot of limestone and copper. Who's responsible over here? I don't know who's the guarding tower. Is it them? Okay. So I'm going to re remove one of you and add a ranger. I think we need to add, train a few more rangers. Okay, cool. I'm going to train a few more diggers. Just five of each. And I th think this guy should 
practically be done with all of his weapon crafting. We have a lot of of them in reserve, so um, I'm all happy to let them continue their merry way and build whatever is required. Weaponsmiths, you are all fine. You can build some iron lances for me, please. Thanks. So these thieves are carrying everything to their small little abode. And, uh, okay, so they are also quite cunning. So this thing is going to be massive. A massive uh, plus to actually have the garrison bolt. Already 25 soldiers, and I'm going to set the claim focus to be on that side. All of these soldiers that I have now in this garrison. And hopefully they bring enough stuff for me. Because then I need to try and expand the claim ball area a little bit, so that would be really cool. Okay, so these specters are quite a problem. So this one I can actually remove a few of them and add some ranges here. Because they, the rangers will be more effective against the spectres. Now we'll see how quickly we actually claim this area once we have the garrison. Which will be fantastic. Yeah, I know they're being attacked by spectres. So I'm really, really sorry about that. Have I actually reset these stone half? So, kind of a waste. Okay, we are producing quite a bit of people. What do they require? It's cloth. So tailor workshops. Um, that's something that I definitely do not have enough. I do believe we have a lot of flax. I think Tailor workshops, you should be fine over here. Maybe another mint. And... Definitely a treasury. Where I'm gonna put it, that's the question. Ah, this is like a good place for a treasury. There we go, just gonna increase the, my unit's capabilities. Yeah, I know you need pickaxes. They will be produced in due time. Don't you worry about that. And I'm going to set your claim focus to be there. So we have some more soldiers up and coming. And then I think I'm going to end the episode. Once we've reached. I defeated this little bandit camp. Okay. Soul point will also be there. But I think they are waiting for the border stones to be delivered. They are stealing silver. And silver is a very precious resource. Okay, so these guys are claiming. That's fine. So there's just. They are not actually. Patrol point should be. Yeah, but that's a bit too far. I can't really patrol the dip there. But they should be able to pick them up. But your claim focus point, I can. Where's the tower again? I can put it here and you are able to claim again. Oh, there's a thief camp. There we go. So. So claim point right there.
Who's killing so many? Cunning and master thieves. Damn, okay. Let's train more peons for me to dispose. <laughs> I guess that sounds really bad, but I, I lost like 30 of them already. It's just quite insane to think about it. Ah, oh, there's a lot of coal here. So please claim that area for me, I would really, really appreciate it. Fantastic, so... Gonna build some coal huts. Let's build two of them. That should be all fine and dandy. Then we should have enough over here. Yeah, I still they still don't have enough. That building of the thieves looks quite modern. Oh no just seemed like it, but that's definitely not the case. Your patrol point should be here as well, please. So everybody who's not claiming... There's ample opportunity for you, yeah. There's so many thieves here. I mean, yeah, I do know that they are not the strongest, and these are cunning thieves, and the rangers are better against the thieves. But, yeah, like I said, these soldiers that I have at the moment, they, they are unfortunately quite the disposable, because wooden spears are super cheap to make. I don't have a lot of them left anymore. But I still have some, some guards here that uh, can be used. Which is all, all good. But um, yeah, I think that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you are excited for the next ones where we're going to try and claim the allies, the allied area, the red area, and maybe the purple one with some trading. And um, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.